and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be doing a smoky liner tutorial for you. Just ignore my face here. I don't know what I'm doing. Um, okay, so today I'm going to be starting out with my eyes. And the first step today is going to be going in with tape. You can go in with scotch tape. This is packing tape. I didn't have any scotch tape. Um, so basically I'm just going to put this on the back of my hand and then just remove it a couple times just to get that stickiness off. And then just place it on your eye wherever you want the angle to be. It's going to feel a little bit bizarre, but trust me, the end result will definitely be worth it. And just make sure that the angles are the same on both eyes. Okay, so just to prime the eyelids, I'm going to go with my Maybelline concealer and put that on my eyelid and then also set that with um, Maybelline Loose Setting Powder. I'm just using my, um, my Miracle Complexion Sponge by Real Techniques to put that on my eyelid to prep the eyelid for eyeshadow. Going in with um, my Morphe M504 and Jaclyn Hills palette. I'm going with this color right here and putting that into the crease. I just want this to be a light wash of color, so I'm not barely putting any pressure on my brush. Just using windshield wiper motions, circles. I'm going in with my Morphe M433, dipping into that color and doing the same technique, um, but this uh, brush is gonna allow us to get deeper into the crease. And one of the beauties about using tape is that you can be as messy as you want, so you don't really have to worry about going outside the lines. Now I'm going into this color right here from the Jaclyn Hill palette and just kind of stamping that along the tape and then kind of moving it into my eyelid a little bit. And this is going to start creating that wing shape, that winged out shape. Now I'm going in with the Urban Decay Naked Ultimate Basics palette, going in with this color right here. And this is going on my lid just to kind of brighten up the eye. This is a matte eyeshadow, so everything on the eyes is going to be matte today. Then I'm going to go in with this pencil brush and dip into the black color in Jaclyn's palette. I'm just going to do a sweeping motion against the, um, the tape and then bring that into my eyelid a little bit. And eventually it'll start looking like a smoky liner. Just keep blending until you get the desired smokiness that you want. And then we can take off the tape. That's so satisfying to watch. <laughs> All right, and now you can see we have perfect, sharp eyeshadow. It's a cool trick and it's so easy. Okay, so today I'm gonna go in with my Risqué Coco lashes. This is my first time using these and they are absolutely beautiful. Now I'm going to be trying this IT Cosmetics um, number 50 collagen serum slash anti-aging primer. I got this as um, as a free sample from Ulta. It smells like oranges. It smells really good. Um, and I thought it actually did a pretty good job at priming my skin. So I might go out and buy that. Maybe. We'll see. <laughs> I did think it actually made my skin feel really soft though. Now you guys already guessed it. I'm going with my L'Oreal Infallible Pro Glow Foundation in 201 Classic Ivory. And blending that out using my Miracle Complexion Sponge. Now I'm going in with my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in 15 Fair, and I'm being pretty generous with this today. Putting it on my nose, my cupid's bow, chin, and a little bit on the forehead, just to give that highlighted effect. What you see me doing here is just putting a little bit of concealer underneath that line and then taking a flat um, brush with a sharp edge so I can get really close to that line with the concealer. Now I'm going back in with the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Setting Powder in 05 Fair and just setting that so it doesn't crease. Okay, so I'm going to do my eyebrows off camera and we are back. Now I'm going into the Jaclyn Hill palette again. I'm going to smoke out the lower lash line using that color right there and a pencil brush. I'm 
Now I'm going into this darker brown, doing the same technique. I'm making it super smoky on the outside and then making it go um, not as smoky as closer you get to the inner corner of the eye. Now I'm going to be using a flat definer brush and putting the black super close to the lower lash line. Now I'm going to be going in with the Urban Decay 24-7 eyeliner in the color Perversion. It's just a black eyeliner and I'm putting that about three-fourths of the way in my waterline. So not all the way to the inner corner, but almost. Now I'm going to use the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. For contour, I'm going to use Shade and Light Palette by Kat Von D in the color Subconscious. You guys already know. And for blush, I'm using IT Cosmetics Bye Bye Pores Blush in Naturally Pretty. For highlight, I'm using Mary Luminizer by The Balm. And then the brush I'm using for this is a Morphe M504. And I'm going to line my lips using this Smashbox lip liner. For lipstick, I'm going in with the Napoleon lipstick in the color Aphrodite. I actually found this to be a little bit on the berry side, so in a minute you'll see me go in with the NYX Liquid Suede liquid lipstick in the color Kitten Heels. And I thought that was definitely better. It's like more of a true red. And to set everything together, we're going to use MAC Fix Plus. So that is it, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope that you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please leave a comment down below. If you feel so inclined, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and give me a thumbs up. Thank you for watching again, and I will see you on my next video.